Okay, happy Monday everyone. We're starting off a new vlog. Welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to see you guys. So I just got ready and I'm about to head out the door because I have a very important meeting at Farmer. Not really, but um, I'm going to the business school for the start of my entrepreneurship accelerator program and so I wanted to just like look cute, dress nice, the whole thing feel good. So I am wearing this sweater which I've shown a bunch I feel like on my Instagram, maybe not so much here on YouTube but it's from J. Crew. I think it's so cute. It comes in a few other colors but I love this pink. I think it's very sweet. And then i just wearing my um, white corduroys because I think that they go really well with it and then I have on these suede booties. Okay, so I just got to the business school. I picked up a salad for lunch. Ebeth just got a tea. She snagged this study room which is so cute so I'm gonna eat here before my three o'clock um, thing. Okay, hello everyone, welcome back. So, happy Monday. It's been a minute in this day um, since I last talked to you. I think I like quickly tried to show you guys my outfit today and then my camera died and then I was at lunch with Elizabeth. So, um, today was the first day of my accelerator program. So, it started and we had our meeting from three to six today. You're shaking. Um, and that was at Farmer, but normally we meet in Cincinnati. So. I had that and that went very well. Met everyone that's gonna be in the cohort and my flight was like a little intimidating. And then I came home and I had salmon for dinner. We all cooked salmon. And then I just got my Instacart order because I ordered a bunch of groceries. Apparently there is like a really big snowstorm coming this week. Um, so I wanted to stock up on some food. And I like don't feel well. Like I just don't feel well right now. My head is like nothing's wrong. I'm in a really good mood. My head hurts so badly and it really hurt throughout the day like during my meeting and stuff and I thought it was because I didn't have like my afternoon coffee but I've just gotten so tired this evening so I'm about to get in the shower and um, get into bed and just go to sleep. It's pretty early but I don't know so this is not good. <laughs> also I undid my alarm clock finally. I still have to set it up. I think you have to get an app for it. I just ran out of storage so it got cut off again. I need to get a bigger SD card but I'm gonna go get ready for bed and go to sleep and hopefully I wake up and feel better tomorrow. But I will see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Okay, so I just made my first meal of the day, which is like a breakfast lunch, but I wanted to make it big because I'm starving. So I made, which I haven't done in forever. I used to do this all the time last semester. I made a little yogurt bowl. So just Greek yogurt, strawberries, blueberries, and some granola. And then I made a little like egg scramble. So three eggs, a bunch of spinach, and then I had some like diced onions. And then I added some salt and pepper. So this looks delicious. I'm gonna eat this and then I will catch up with you guys because I just got off of a very important fun meeting that I wanted to discuss, but I am so hungry. <laughs> talk to you a lot today for our Tuesday but so many interesting things going on and I did want to share with you because at 11 o'clock I had a very lovely meeting I am now working with a business coach which was recommended by my dad for me to use had our first meeting today which was over zoom I kind of just like explained everything we went over some stuff and then he actually like asked me he was like oh have you ever taken any personality tests or um, anything like that and through Miami I had taken like the HBDI test and then he was like have you ever used Cloverleaf and I was like yes I used it one time last semester just for a group project in regards to like that group so then he was like okay well you probably have all of your answers like all of your results like why don't you pull them up so then I pulled them up during the meeting and I had never really like gone through any of the results and I didn't even see like half of the stuff that was on here so he was taking notes and he was like this is just gonna help me help you because I know how you 
work and your behaviors and stuff like that so on the clover leaf we like looked at my disc and i highly recommend anyone taking this like not sponsored by clover leaf but i just think it's so insightful to know how you operate as a person i don't think there's anything wrong with that so i was like looking at my answers and it's interesting because so i was 86 like the number 86 I'm an influence of an influence, which is funny because he was like, that's exactly what you're doing. So it says places emphasis on influencing or persuading others, openness, relationships, motivated by social recognition, group activities, and relationships. And so I have a super high influence and I think I put more value in the relationships. And then my second, the one that was the second highest was conscientious. So that was person places emphasis on quality and accuracy, expertise, competency, motivated by opportunities to gain knowledge, showing their expertise and quality work, which I also feel like kind of lines up. And then the third one was just steadiness. So I thought this was so interesting because it kind of explains a lot more about myself. I did want to share that with you because I just had a very insightful, lovely conversation and I'm excited to continue to work with him. So like I said, it's going to be like once a week that we're meeting. But I also did want to like share this with you guys because I thought that this could also be helpful. One, for you guys to like actually take the Cloverleaf test to learn more about yourself. So I am now think I'm going to hop on Instagram and I'm going to share some of my favorites from the month on my Insta story. So be sure to go follow me there. Also my sweater um, was sent to me. It's new. I wanted to wear it for February 1st because I thought that it was like super valentine's day and whatever um this is from libby cat they sent it to me it's like the sister store to lisa lurch it's so adorable and really cozy perfect for february so i will leave a link to the sweater down below but definitely check it out i posted about it on my instagram and lots of you were asking me questions about it and i highly recommend i also need to go to the copy shop the Oxford Copy Shop um, to pick up a textbook for Elizabeth, so we might do that. And then in the afternoon, I want to go to Cofenia and work because I do have some like classwork that I need to do. And then tonight, I have my capstone meeting over Zoom, which is from six to eight, and that's every Tuesday as well. That's kind of the outline for today, but I feel like we've already done a lot. I also talked to my mom this morning, um, which was very nice. And then I had my meeting. I had a really good lunch. Had my coffee. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go do the Instagram stuff, and then I will check back with you guys in a little bit. I'm gonna get out of the house for a second because. I can feel this pounding headache coming back like I think it's coffee but I I'm not it's not like confirmed last night I literally thought I was getting sick but then this morning I woke up and I felt totally fine so I'm not getting sick um maybe it's the weather but like it's a beautiful day out so I don't actually know what's going on I'm gonna go confirm and see if it is coffee by getting a coffee because now I'm just like freaking myself out so we're gonna go to get a coffee go to CVS uh, because we need paper towels and I need to pick something up and then I need to go to the UPS store because I just got a notification that I got a package and then I'm going to go to the Oxford coffee shop and get Elizabeth's book and then take it to her because she has a really busy day and I will be over in that area and then we're going to come back here that is my update for right now maybe these glasses are giving me a headache but I haven't had them on for that long for like them to really make an impact in my life that's the update i'm having a really great day and um i'll probably talk to you guys in the car okay so we just went to the ups store i didn't even realize that i had packages there but we just got a really exciting package and i'm gonna do an unboxing um when i get home now i have to go to cvs because i need um cotton balls and paper towels but it's so warm out it's like hot like i had to change and I need to take my jacket off because I'm burning up in here. But we're going to go into um, CVS right now. So I just got back from errands, which kind of took a little longer. Everything was like moving in slow motion, which was kind of killing me. But now we're back at the apartment. And I was going to do an unboxing, which I am still going to do, of the packages that I got and some of the new PR. But I also need to finish some stuff before the Zoom tonight. Um, so... I think I'm gonna have to go do that and then hopefully I can come back and film the rest of the stuff. It's not even an assignment, it's like this one thing, but I just really can't focus here right now. Um, and then that way I can do the unboxing and I won't be stressed out that I have to finish what I have to do tonight. Tonight I have my capstone class, which is just the cohort of kids that is getting work from the capstone. They send it down to us. We meet every Tuesday from six to eight. Um, today we're meeting the client. They're coming into the Zoom. Uh, so it's gonna be like, I think just introductions and I have to present like a minute presentation about who I am. So I'm gonna go to Kofenia and then um, I will see you guys later.
welcome back happy Wednesday this week is flying by I can't believe we're already here um, I just got ready for the day I just put on yet another pink sweater this whole week I think I'm gonna try and wear a pink sweater every day because I'm really just committing to the theme for February so um, yeah, just kind of got ready, had my breakfast, had my yogurt bowl, which I showed you guys, and now I want to sit down, and there's just so many exciting packages in my room that I thought it'd be fun to do a big unboxing to start off today, and a few packages just arrived, so I'm going to show you guys that. Um, so I think I'll do that. This camera battery appears to be dying, so I think I have another one fully charged. Um, so I'm going to set you guys up and show you all the fun goodies that have arrived. Okay, so this is an interesting background. I'm just quite literally sitting on the floor, but I wanted space to do this unboxing. So I did just share some of the items over on Instagram, um, but you guys obviously get the in-depth version. So the first few things are PR, and then I did receive a few fun things that I ordered in the mail that came today. So I think we should, where is all my stuff? So some of these things, like it's different what I'm doing for each of the brands and stuff like that, but I'm just gonna do a full roundup here on my YouTube channel. So the first, I'm like so excited, I could scream through the camera right now. Okay, so the first company that I'm gonna be working with over on TikTok is Paravel, and they are a travel company, and a brand that I have known about for years. They have really high quality luggage items and travel pieces. And so they sent me a few pieces and this is like their sustainable line that they sent me, which I absolutely love. So it looks like this. Open her up. Oh my gosh, it's monogrammed. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, you guys. Look how cute this is. Wait, I am dying. Oh my gosh. Hey, okay, look how cute this is. It is a full on foldable, sustainable travel bag. And I got it in black and white. I didn't even realize that the um, straps were piped in white and then they personalized it with EOC. This is beyond. And I mean, you guys know we do tons of traveling, but also in the summertime, we go back and forth between our lake house. And so I'm always looking for easy overnight bags and especially things that can store easily. And when I'm at school, you guys know I have a teeny tiny little room. So trying to keep things compact and even now I'm like, oh my gosh, the walls are closing in on me. Like sometimes I'll leave things in my car, but this is so perfect because you can wrap it all up. This is the first item and that was thrilling. This is the fold up backpack. Oh my God, look at the backpack. Look at the backpack. I had no idea this was so cute. And then it comes with a front pocket zipper. I'll put this it's definitely like a, it's like a mini backpack. So this is what it looks like. Obviously, you like need to fill it up. I'm so excited to be working with Paravel. Okay, and then this is the fold-up wash kit. I'm getting overheated. I'm so excited. Okay, this is so cute. This is what it looks like. Just a really easy, compact fold-up little dob kit, and they all match. And the personalization is sending me over the edge. Like how darling functional and amazing are these items Paravel you have outdone yourself I am so excited to be working with you guys you will be seeing this over on TikTok and I'm actually going I don't even think I told you this I'm going on a trip for a week at the end of February and I'm really excited about it and I'm going to be taking all of these items with me it's going to be perfect it's perfect timing and then also we have spring break coming up and just wow how exciting so i will leave paravel's information down below okay i really hope this is focusing this next package is from another this is like fully crooked isn't it this next package is from another huge brand and this is a funny story so i was in palm beach and we went to that like pop-up shop poppy caravan event that was at the colony hotel and they had a lot of different vendors and one of the tables was this brand and i was like oh my gosh i have always loved their earrings their jewelry. Literally the next day I get an email from them and they were originally going to send the earrings down to Palm Beach but unfortunately they didn't get there in time and then we ended up there was like a mix up and they had to forward it to school so it was several weeks later. However we are now working together. So Magnana Gavigan sent me two pairs of earrings and I'm sure that you have probably seen or heard these before. This is based out of New York. Um, they have super high quality jewelry and they're mostly known for their earrings. So I received two of their beautiful pairs of earrings and the first pair I'm definitely going to be wearing for Valentine's Day and then the second pair would have been so perfect in Palm Beach but I have some warmer trips coming up soon so I can't wait to pull these out. So this is what the first pair of earrings look like and this is definitely what I will be centering my balance. Valentine's Day outfit around absolutely gorgeous earrings and I'm pretty sure they're like known for this style of kind of like that 
I'm calling it like a fan earring, but they have a bunch of different sizes. Look at these amazing earrings. Like this is beautiful. They are these gorgeous, I think they're flamingos, and I mean, just stunning. These would have been so perfect in Palm Beach. A little bit more of an investment. These I think are like $350, um, whereas these are $125. So there's different price points that you can purchase on the website and there's so many different styles but I'm living for these bright colors as you can see I've really been into pink so it's quite fitting so I am so excited to let you guys know that I actually have a coupon code for you guys to use and it's Emily on Bose 15 and that will get you 15% off I'm so thrilled that I am able to share a coupon code with you all and I will leave the link down below and if you do purchase something please send me pictures I am obsessed with their jewelry I want every single pair of earrings that they have and I'm excited to start styling them as well first being Valentine's Day okay next a company called Necklet reached out and they sent me one of their clasps and I really like this company because I thought it was super interesting so let's say you have like three different necklaces in your jewelry box that always get tangled or you want to wear and like make them look layered what you can do is you purchase this and it has basically like clasps to layer your necklaces and you can get them to layer um, like I think three to six or two to four so I did the two to four one um, and it's just gold and you put it on the back of your necklace and it keeps them all together this is just something to keep in your back pocket and I will also leave a link to this um, brand as well okay last but certainly not least this is also something so exciting and another um, Kind of like brand collaboration that came out of Palm Beach. So when we went to the Poppy Caravan pop-up shop, one of the brands that was there was Sue Sarter, and I posted. We purchased one of her beautiful handmade dresses, um, and I posted about it when I was in Palm Beach, and the TikTok did really well. And then her and I made this great connection, and we started talking back and forth just about how we could work together and collaborate. She is so lovely, and basically she was like, "I would love for you to be." an ambassador for um, the brand. So she was so nice and Sue sent me another dress and she sent this one directly to school um, and I haven't even opened it yet because I wanted to wait for you guys. When I was in Palm Beach, I first of all, we got so many compliments on the dress. I wore it, I think I actually wore it twice in the trip and my mom wore it because what's great about her dresses is it's like one size fits all. So I wore the dress, my mom wore the dress, I think Elizabeth wore the dress, I wore it multiple times, like I am obsessed. Okay, work with me here people also I've been wearing my blue light glasses on my head because they keep my hair out of my face and I just I sometimes I honestly off camera I will literally have a clip in my hair most times because I just have to have my hair out of my face so now we've replaced it with blue light glasses which are from Amazon which I can oh my god link down below this is gonna be oh, love it oh my god there is so much in here right now <laughs> I'm so happy. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is the first dress. Looks like this. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And it comes with a matching belt. So you obviously like tie it around similar to how my other dress was. This next dress. Beautiful. Oh my gosh. Look how gorgeous this is, guys. These are handmade. Just like, look at that. Look at that. I, this was too nice. She did not have to do this. And then the matching belt as well. There's more. Oh my gosh, look at this one. Okay, so this is a shorter, yeah, this is I think a shorter dress as well. Kind of like a mid-length, probably hits a little bit below the knee. Beautiful, this puff sleeve. I can't even handle it. I like these darker colors because I, I obviously live in Ohio and you're not constantly in Palm Beach. So this is, like she said, perfect transition pieces. And then we have this longer one as well. So I think she sent two short ones and two long ones. I am dying. And again, I need to put these on for you guys. Once I'm self tan this week, I will do a full on fashion show because just holding this up, I can see how it would be difficult to vision it. But I'm telling you when I wore my white and green one in Palm Beach, like it's so flattering, it's so comfortable, and I got so many compliments. I can't believe she just sent me four of these dresses. Um, I'm screaming crying throwing up okay i had to come back to the desk because i wanted to double check on oh, okay i look crazy i wanted to double check on codes for you guys so you will be able with my code to get 50 dollars off your purchase for the sue starter dresses with my code emily it will also be down below in the description box and yada 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 it's now available site-wide so you guys can start shopping use my code 
you can get that $50 off. If you have spring break coming up, um, if you have a warm trip, definitely look at her beautiful handmade dresses. It's such an original piece and you really stand out. And I am so honored that she just sent me four of her gorgeous dresses. And so I am so excited to start posting again. When I have self tan on, I will try those dresses on so you can see them on and how they fit and move around a little bit. Um, and I'm just so excited. Okay. So that was like the PR portion of this video. I know that went on for quite some time. So I appreciate you listening to me. I really wanted the mini Uggs because you know, everyone's been wearing them. I was able to find off of Dillard's like a it's not the mini Ugg, but I don't anticipate them coming in stock anytime soon. And like it's full on February, so I wanted them immediately. So I did find these on Dillard's. So these do have a zipper. I honestly can't even really, like you're not even gonna notice. There's still that small Ugg vibe and I also wanted it in the chestnut color. There's a snowstorm hitting starting tonight. So I will probably get to use them right away. The other thing that I got from H&M, which I probably will again be wearing when it's like, it's raining today, so it would have been not appropriate to wear this. Um, but I really wanted like a big oversized like teddy jacket, cozy vibes to like wear with my mini Uggs and a set and my hat and cashmere scarf, that kind of vibe. Um, but again, I didn't want, I just wanted like an easy piece that I could wear for like two months. So I ordered one off of H&M. It's, a, I'm not gonna lie. I don't know if it's like, completely the most flattering it's a little overwhelming but it's such a cozy vibe that i'm okay with it okay so i also have a chunky sweater on right now so that could also be like a factor but like it's pretty cute and like i would wear it with a sweater and leggings and a little hat this is what it looks like she's large but we like her and it's really cozy i'm not wearing the correct outfit i'll style it better later on i'm thinking leggings a cream cashmere sweater, my scarf, my little J. Crew hat, my mini Uggs. We could make it work, but if you wanna check this out, I don't think it was that expensive on H&M. Again, it was one of those things that I just wanted to like kind of test out. Like, I don't think we completely hit the mark, but <laughs> it's still cute. Um, so that was something else that I purchased from H&M. And then I did also order these long pants from H&M, a wide leg, kind of like ribbed. I love this color. I guess it's a sweatpant, it's more of like a loungewear pant. I feel like I've been seeing these everywhere, especially on TikTok. And there's a pair from Blue Salt that I really want, but they were sold out. So I figured I would start with the H&M pair, see how often I wear them, and then kind of like do my own review, and then go from there. But I think they're so cute, and again, now that I have my mini Uggs, this would be really cute to pair. I will leave a link down below for those. And then I also got from H&M this little vest, and I thought this would be cute because sometimes when you go out, like it's cold, but you don't want to wear a million layers. And so I could wear a sweater underneath this or like a little zip up of some sort. And it's just this little navy vest puffer from H&M. Again, super easy, basic piece. Okay, just took a quick break. Got a little afternoon coffee. Um, don't need it, but wanted it. So we're kind of on a roll with things and I just wanted to keep that moving. I think I'm gonna have a little snack. I got these sweet potato chips, which I might try from Kroger. Um, and then we're gonna clean the room because it stops everywhere from our little unboxing that we did. But hopefully that wasn't too chaotic. I will obviously watch the footage back when I edit it, but I think we should be good. Okay, I was just having the snack and I wanted to share what I'm eating. Um, Casey wanted to recreate it. So I got this everything but the bagel like dip at Kroger. It was on like, I did an Instacart and it just like popped up. So I got it and it's delicious. And I've been eating it with these simple organic sweet potato corn chips. And it's a really good combination. So I always need, like afternoon I, I hit a trough. So I always like need a snack. Oh, it's good. So. Yeah, that's just a little recommendation for you. Edith just called. I think we're gonna go to dinner tonight because classes got canceled for everyone. So she doesn't have class tomorrow. My guess is that it just got moved to Zoom, but we're gonna go to dinner and then the snowstorm's hitting tonight. So my guess is that we like will kind of be homebound like Thursday, Friday, maybe Saturday, I don't know. So we're gonna go to Pickle and Pig tonight because I went there over the weekend for the first time and it was really, really good. It's just a restaurant like right here in Oxford. We are in the car now. We're, we're actually in a battlefield of a parking lot right now. <laughs> we're at Kroger, Kelly and I came 
because we just needed to get a few more things. Everyone's freaking out about the snowstorm. I'm mostly getting stuff for Elizabeth just in case she gets stuck in her room and a few other things. Oh, it's raining, but we're still able to travel freely with our cars. Okay, so Elizabeth and I decided to go out to dinner before the snowstorm yes, hits. Exactly. We're at Pickle and Pig. Because yes, I have a yes. snow day today. We have a snow day tomorrow. It will starting tomorrow. Um, it's such a cute place. Look at the bar. It used to be MIA um, if you guys go here. But now it's like more club vibes. I got a Moscow mule. <laughs> and you okay, got I gotta go. <laughs> and you got a ginger beer. Is, really is it good? This crushed ice. It's in a get a I got the crushed ice. ice. It's in a really cute glass. So happy. But she had a meeting from 6 30 to 7 30 and then I picked her up and now we're having dinner. This is like our new spot. Just, I haven't um, seen you like just you. I know we've been a while. It's been the two of us. So we're enjoying we ordered an appetizer and our uh, we got salads for dinner. So we're feasting. We just got the Caesar salad here with chicken and then we also got some fries and our Moscow mule you're so we are living life can you see oh my god there's there's a whole group of people so let's just like do we know them do we know them yoohoo Okay, we are dropping Eva back off at the dorm and we will see you to maybe we'll actually no I probably wait that's the thing I'm not gonna probably see you for a little bit because of the snow okay say bye okay bye, bye vlog love you kisses see you tomorrow so um as you guys know I have worked with print fresh before they have sent me some of their darling pajamas and they sent me some more and it came in this really cute reusable tote which I think is perfect because it's so cute and I can also use it for like groceries and stuff. Um, so they sent me two new pairs of their pajamas and I do have a coupon code. This is what the first pair looks like. Um, they are like the blue version of the cheetah print pajamas that I have but I like it because it's fresh pajamas. And then the other pair, these really fun green ones and I think they have like unicorns all over them um, or zebras or something fun like that. So I'm really excited because I'm gonna wear um, a new pair of these for our snow day so it can be super cozy. I think I'm gonna wear the blue pair because I love the cheetahs. So I will also leave Print Fresh's information down below. I love their pajamas. They're so cozy and really cute and just something to look forward to for bedtime. Oh.